Hi, my name is Ivan and today I'm going to make a video review of uh, Steers Climbing Wheelchair GTS 5. And I will tell you about this model comparing to the previous model GTS 3 and uh, I will not compare it uh, to the GTS 4 because we decided to get rid of uh, GTS 4 model because it was uh, very similar uh, visually to the GTS 3 model and very similar technically to GTS 5 model. Uh, that's why not to get a mess in your head, uh, we will get rid of GTS 4 and compare GTS 5 uh, to GTS 3. So let's start. So first of all, uh, what is the, the first thing you can see is the appearance of this model. So it has very, very uh, nice sport design with these plastic coverings. So just take a look to its exterior and it's very, very nice. So the back lamps was moved from the battery side to the, uh, to, to the outer side. So it's very important when you drive in the night and um, other drivers should see the sizes of your vehicle. So it's very, very important in, in terms of safety. The next things uh, are coverings of the track system front and back side. So it's not just a visual part, uh, it also uh, protects the track system from other, um, from other objects and protects the tracks from slipping down. So that is very, very important. Next thing is a seat. Uh, here is an orthopedic seat uh, that has a support uh, side support on the back side and uh, downside and the um, central part of this seat has the same color as the whole wheelchair so blue wheelchairs has a blue ins insert and uh, gray has a gray insert hey, yep next thing uh, the adjustments of the seat the seat can be adjusted, uh, the back of the seat can be adjusted in a very wide range. So now it's like 85 degrees to the mm, cushion. Um, it can be mm, adjusted like this, like this, and even it can be transformed into a bed. So uh, you can even adjust the angle of the leg rest so and you transform this wheelchair into a bed so this can be very helpful when you spend a lot of time in a wheelchair uh, when you have like long changes um, um, when when you fly somewhere so this can help uh, to you to take rest, to improve your blood circulation and all these things. Next thing is a transportation position. This uh, model has a less height of the wheelchair in a transportation position. So the height in transportation position is only 70 centimeters. So it means that this wheelchair can fit in um, almost every CUV. So, uh, but you have a, you need to have a trunk height more than 70 centimeters, and you even don't need to uh, pick the wheelchair up. You just uh, put a ramp in your trunk, and the wheelchair goes there by itself. So you can do it alone. No need uh, anybody's help. Next thing, uh, the leg rest. The leg rest can be adjusted uh, easily with one palm only. So there is a very um, user-friendly handle here. So, and it can be fixed and released with one movement only. Next thing is a uh, side cushion uh, for the leg uh, so it means that uh, this cushion protects the leg 
from uh, the friction uh, with the bolts and screws, all these things. So when you spend a lot of time in a wheelchair, it will help you a lot. Uh, next thing is uh, this support. This support is adjusted uh, uh, up and down and also can be adjusted uh, in the front side and back side. Next thing is uh, this um, part, leg rest part, and it has uh, uh, chamfers here. So even if you will increase the length of the leg rest a lot, this leg rest will not touch the wheels. So it's very, very helpful. Uh, that is very important that you can remove this leg rest with one movement only. You just push this button, pull the leg rest up and that's all. Very, very easy. If you need to uh, get in the wheelchair, so you just remove the leg rest if it's an obstacle for you and put it back very, very, very easy uh, with the one movement only. When you will need to get in the wheelchair or to get off the wheelchair, you will need to take off the armrest. Here, you just uh, pull it up and you slide it. So very, very easy. And now you have a space to jump in the wheelchair. Uh, here is a place for the arm also. So you can use this space to hold your body uh, when jumping in. The armrest can be adjusted uh, up and down by losing this screw. So it can be adjusted from this height to this height. So it will, it has a very, a very big range of uh, adjustment. Uh, the next comfortable part is the armrest cushion. So it has a very, very natural gap here. And uh, the front uh, side of this uh, cushion goes down. So it provides very comfortable line of your arm on this cushion. The next adjustment is the position of the uh, controller. The controller uh, can be moved forward or backward and also the uh, angle of the controller can be adjusted. So it can be set like this or like this. So you can adjust it by uh, according to your needs. Also the controller can be moved easily from right side to the left side. The next thing is that the GTS-5 has an option uh, as an attendant joystick. So if the person cannot control the joystick well by himself, uh, so sometimes people uh, buy this option for kids or for elderly or for disabled people who cannot uh, control uh, the joystick well because of shaking hands or something. So the attendant joystick can be added. So there is a uh, socket under the seat for the uh, second uh, controller. So the both controller can be installed on a single wheelchair. Now let's talk about technical characteristics. So the first thing I need to tell you is that the GTS-5 model is controlled very, very precisely. So it means that it do exactly what you want. So it's achieved because the uh, GTS-5 model has uh, encoders on each wheel and the controlling system understand uh, at what position your wheel is at each second. So that's why um, the wheelchair do exactly what you want. So it's very important. Uh, the next thing is that uh, the tracks of the GTS-5 are stronger than on GTS-3. This uh, teeth has a uh, more, has a bigger size, uh, has more width. 
and uh, that's why they are very reliable even uh, if you uh, use it in very uh, rough conditions like turning on the sport on asphalt and all this and situations like this uh, the next thing is a chain. Uh, the chain on GTS 5 is stronger than on GTS 3. That's why it's more reliable. So that was an um, overview of GTS 5 model comparing to GTS 3 model. Thank you very much for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video and if you have any questions regarding to this model, regarding to previous models, uh, regarding to capable technologies, please write in comments and uh, I'll be happy to answer you. Thank you very much. Bye.